Peace and love, family. Welcome to Night and Day Talk Media. R. Kelly calls WAC 100 from prison to speak on Diddy's current troubles. R. Kelly says he doesn't believe any of it. He further says people want to laugh and joke on the radio, not knowing they could be next. Yeah, that's all over the news. I see. We see that. We watch that. And what's crazy is, what you know, I know, you know, because we've just been in the Diddy forever, is, is once they... And I hope they don't. But if they detain him, that's when all nigga niggas motherfuckers gonna be lining up with their hand in there. So I'm saying, man, see the bad part about him. This is what I don't understand about this all this shit. Mother, if there was a time right where this was a play, this was y'all party. This was y'all nigga. And, and, like if you was um, a participant, right? And you of legal age. I don't understand what all the hoopla. All of a sudden, it's against the wheel. It's against the wheel. Man, what's up? You just came back to 300 parties, motherfucker, against the wheel. <clears throat> all this shit, you got to damn near get a turn on your camera, let a motherfucker tell you who they is, put their ID up, let a motherfucker tell you where they at, because any given Sunday, right, when a motherfucker want to go bad, they can extort you or come with the accusations. Shit, that shit is crazy, man. It's crazy. That's why I say motherfuckers, motherfuckers gonna be out there laughing and, make, and making comedian jokes and doing all other shit on the radio and everything else, but they ask to be next. You know what yeah. I'm saying? That's what's so yeah, fucked that's up real about shit. They're so stupid. They're so stupid. They don't even realize the move that's going on. I mean, it's crazy, yeah, man. I mean, that's why I don't believe none of the shit. I mean, no, I told them straight funny. up, bro. You can tell me about anybody in now. You can tell me uh, the, on the news the weather is the sky is blue. I'm not gonna believe the shit, no. Because I'm listen. in it now. I know what they did. Yeah, like, listen, I told at, when it first started with Cassie, I said, yo. Nigga, this is a stick-up move. All the balls, that nigga, I just came out saying, hey, listen, these are my sexual preferences. Yes, I'm bi or whatever the fuck, and these right. motherfuckers been trying to extort me, and I'm tired of it. They know that I'm in the music industry and boom, boom, boom. Nigga, they would have ate her up and, and still, but but now they using that. They using that against him. That, but now it's getting to a point to where, you know, it's getting to a point to where it's like, nigga, you, 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 you gonna have to say something. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, he, not, but he, 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 ain't, he ain't fleeced though long, you know. Nah, he ain't no, no, nah, he ain't. They, they didn't raid it. You know, they ran up in his cribs, but you know yeah, I saw that. Crib, this how you know it's weak. You know, usually when they run up in the house, they coming to get you too. Yeah. They look at they still searching and looking like that nigga ain't on the run or that they ain't telling him to come turn himself in or no shit like that. They grounded his plane because they seen him moving, he wasn't even on the plane. They wanted to make sure he wasn't because they, they probably didn't restrict his passport and shit as of yet, as of now. You know, but yeah, this shit is crazy. Yeah, but that's how it all started, though, Wack. You understand? It started. No, I know. No, I know. It's it all that because they don't, you know, it's, it's crazy, man. I know, but see, it's they know fucking but... with him. He got some money, so they know they got to come right. They know if they come half stepping, he do got the money to, 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 to fight. So they ain't finna. They ain't go. Well, I do know this. If they do put him in cuffs, they only put him on cut and cuff because they got a definite. They got something at that point. So, yeah, so. That, ain't, that, ain't necessary. that ain't even necessarily true right there. Well, they, well, they, they feel like they got this enough. Call. Let's they, they, got enough. they want they, you or they want a plan to get you or if it's a conspiracy, yeah. anything. They put you in cuffs, bro. <laughs> no, that's real. And I've been telling people, I've been preaching. I said, yo, one thing already taught me what I didn't know. Is we going off this state shit, nigga? The law of the land when it comes to the feds is eighteen across the board. You niggas in Jersey, with the sixteen, Nevada and Atlanta, that's the state. But if the feds want to come in and pick it up, ain't yep. nothing the state can do to help you or save you. You can't say what the state. Yep, the law of the land federally is eighteen. I said I didn't even know that until you know I thought you know whatever the state said that's what it was. She is, which is crazy. Like, it's crazy. I don't know why the federal law don't force state law to be 18 across the board. It's crazy. Millions of people have been using detoxification supplements to remove harmful toxins, pollutants, heavy toxic metals, as well as to balance pH levels, lower the risk of viruses like cold and flu, support the immune system, and improve nutrient absorption. What is zeolite? Zeolite is a volcanic ash that forms over time when ash and lava react with alkalized water, resulting in a compound with a very strong cage-like structure and a negative charge. 
Zeolite is one of the most fascinating and powerful nature remedies available. Great to detox and balance your body. Health benefits of detoxing. The removal of excess heavy metals can improve overall health. Detoxification helps balance a body's pH levels. This product provides 30 capsules, one month supply. Ships within three days. Purchase now at night and daynetmarket.com. Thank you.